Same matchups, different point spreads on the boys' court. Skyview could be a state contender this year, but we just don't know yet how they'll look without Raekwon Evans. The Falcons playing their first game in four years without the graduated All-State point guard. So they go a little more inside now. 6'10 junior Zach Schott threw the double team up and under for the bucket. Now a two-man game. Logan DeHaven drives baseline, then drops it off for Schott, who goes up and throws it down with two hands. It's nice to play basketball when you're 6'10". Then some defense. Alex Schaff with the steal. Threads the needle on the bounce pass to a streaking Jeremiah Warner for the deuce. Skyview looks good tonight. 60-40. to 40. They are victors in the opener. We told you at 5.30 also, seniors boys can play any number of styles. Taking on Hellgate, we go right to the fourth. Hellgate up one. Raleigh Worcester drives the lane, feels the contact, hoop, and the harm. Old-fashioned three-point play. Hellgate up 40-36. Up six now, but Connor Kickbush cuts that in half as he quick fires from the left wing. Money under a minute left, though, too much Worcester. Gets inside, fights through the contact, and lays it up and in again. Hellgate survives a close one. 51-50, your final for the Knights. Finally, we end where we began. The Golden Dome for West Sentinel. The Spartans come out flying. Sam Bigley takes the handoff, goes all the way to the bucket, and finishes. But threes will help you catch up in a hurry, and West made a lot of them. Jesse Owens from the wing. That one goes down. But Bigley was the star tonight from NBA range. Nothing but the bottom. He had a steal and a layup with two seconds left to break a tie as Sentinel gets the 64-62 win in the dome.